Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is all about the Graco Cradle Me 4-in-1 Baby Carrier. So you guys ask me a lot of times about my go-to baby gear items and Graco is one of my favorite companies for go-to baby items like this. You guys may remember when I worked with Graco last year and I talked about their Moe's Nest stroller. I love doing that video so much and you guys seem to really like the breakdown, all the specs about it, all the information. So today's video is going to be very similar but we're going to be talking about this carrier here that stroller by the way we still use every single day when we go to the park it has been such a great staple item in our household even as Christian has grown up we still continue to use it I know I'm always showing it on Instagram and it's just a favorite item of ours so like I said I love Graco they're a company I stand by and that I continue to get great items from them today's video is actually a partnership with Graco so thank you so much to them for sponsoring today's video so without further ado let's get into this four-in-one carrier so like I said this is called the cradle me four-in-one this is the box and you can see on the bottom all the different ways you can use it so it does have four different uses so you can have your baby facing in either in the newborn seat or the baby seat so you can kind of adjust the carrier to fit dependent on the size of your baby there is no newborn insert needed for this carrier so I'll definitely walk you through like how to position and everything but just know you don't need any additional pieces for it or any additional kind of newborn insert so that's a plus plus. and then of course aside from carrying the baby facing in you can carry this with the baby facing out as well or you can back carry with this carrier as well too. So this will give you a little bit of an idea, just the images on the bottom of the box here. So the main thing that makes this carrier so great is actually how you clip the baby in. So typically, you know, you might want to hold the baby and then sort of strap and deal with all these straps and different things like flailing extra pieces with the baby right in front of you. With this one, it has this secure connect clips on the top that you see right here. And the reason why these are so great is because you can actually open it up. You can strap yourself in and sort of have the bare bones like like caged back of the carrier, put your baby in and then just clip it closed like this. So it's much easier to actually get your baby in the carrier and get yourself situated. I've talked many times about how when Jordan was working from the office, there would be so many times I had to put Christian in the carrier all on my own. And some of them I just could not get. If you couldn't reach right or if there were too many pieces of fabric you're working with, it can be really difficult to strap a baby into a carrier all by yourself. And so this makes it so much easier. These have two secure buckles on the front right like that and then there's just a little side button you push. It opens them up. It actually has a magnet built into it as well as a little latch. I'm going to show you guys a close-up so you can see. You can see how this is moving a little bit like that but it's got a latch built into it as well as a magnet so you don't have to worry about getting the perfect fit. You can actually just clip it like that. It's super easy and then a button to undo it. You can see how many times I'm quickly doing this right here. So it's that easy to use on both sides. I talked about the four modes of function and how you can carry your baby four different ways with this carrier. If you're ever second guessing how to actually do that, again, it can be kind of fussy sometimes with your typical carriers to get the baby in. There's actually a how-to guide built into the bottom of this carrier, which is so awesome. So on the very bottom, you actually have this little hidden pocket right here. And from that, you can roll out the instruction manual. It doubles as a weather protectant cover. So you can see here, it actually covers the whole front of the carrier. So no matter the weather, this will protect your baby. It's actually a really breathable, really lightweight fabric. So even if it covers them when it's a little bit warm or sunny, they'll still be able to breathe just fine in it. Um, but it will protect them from any of the elements outside. And then the reverse on the back of it is actually a step-by-step -step diagram of how to get your baby in there. So if you're ever forgetting how to actually function in this thing or how to do all the buckles, you can just hold this out right in front of you and look at it right here and you've got a step-by-step -step guide reminding you how. This is genius to me because do you know how many times you get a box with a baby item like this and it comes with a big thick manual and I have so many of those manuals that I hold onto that I then have to dig up and the papers become crumpled or I lose them when we moved, we lost a bunch of our manuals like that. Um, and so having it built into the product right here is just simplifying it for the mom, which is what we're all about. 
On top of that, when you are deciding whether you want baby to face out or you want baby to face you, there's actually a customizable little fit right here. These buttons at the very bottom, right where your baby's little legs go. You can customize whether you have it on a tighter setting like this, like I do. This will allow the baby to face out and it kind of brings this fabric in a little bit so that their legs aren't, you know, spread eagle right like that. Sometimes when babies are facing out in carriers, it makes their legs spread so much that Arlo actually hated that in previous carriers and he doesn't mind it in this one because I'm able to customize the fit there. But then if you want baby to face you, it's really easy to just undo the little strap around that buckle and now it has a wider fit so it can protect their hips when they're facing you and kind of cradling you that way. It also does the same thing up top. So this part right here can unbuckle or unbutton and provide the head support to your baby like this fit a little bit higher up and provide the head support to the back of their head and their neck if they're facing you. And then when the baby's facing out, you just buckle it down and that gives them the space they need to see out. There's also a little, again, a little hidden pocket right here on the top of like the bib that faces out and it actually just snaps open or snaps shut and in there is an extra sun protectant cover as well too. So this will roll out. It's got the snaps that you need to snap behind you and it can actually snap to the back of the straps like this and cover your baby's head if you're out in the sun. This is key for us being in California because sometimes if we take our kids hiking or we're at the beach earlier in the day, I know I've gotten a lot of questions for you guys about how from you guys about how we protect Arlo from the sun in the summertime and this is one of those ways you can do so. Again, it's really breathable. You can see this material is super stretchy, so it won't overheat them. It will still give them a lot of breathability but it's gonna keep them covered and protected from the sun that way. Then on the back, you've got this snap here like your typical carriers might have, a snap here to keep, you know, everything tight and right on the back here. But what's extra cool about this one is that you can actually slide this buckle. You see this backtrack right here with like this sort of rail. It's a little tight, which is good because you want your baby to be tight, but you can actually move the buckle to either be higher up on the track or to be lower on the track. So again, you're getting that customized fit, whether you're wearing it or your partner is wearing it. Um, you can make sure it's really customized for you. And what I love about that is that you can move the buckle up really high if it fits well for you and baby, and then you can reach behind you and buckle it yourself. Cause again, I'm always thinking of ways I can put these things on all by myself. So that is genius to me as well. That's an extra feature that I don't typically see on baby carriers. The straps themselves are really thick as well too. You can see that they have like extra padding here. So you're not gonna feel uncomfortable. You're not gonna feel like it's tugging you. When I carry Arlo in this, I'm actually always so impressed with how secure and just like upright and tight he feels, but I feel really comfortable because a lot of times when you're carrying your baby in something like this, you can start to feel that pressure like it's pulling on your shoulders or like their weight is pulling down, even if your you know, carrier is put together properly. And so with this, I don't feel that same type of strain because the shoulders and the straps and everything are so padded and such great quality. There's also lumbar support built into the back strap. So you've got this secure little back padding right here that will support your lower back. That is so clutch. I have lost this on past carriers and it ends up making it so that this thin little strap is like pulling on your back. But with this one, you don't have to worry about that because it's actually built into the snap. So you're not gonna lose it. It's not gonna come off or fall off when you're traveling. It's built in and really secure that way. And then again, you can customize the fit and adjust the straps actually in two different places on the lower back there. You've got a place to adjust it on each side of that lumbar support. And then another thing while I'm here that I'll show you is that if you do have extra slack on the straps, like the extra fabric that hangs like this, there's these handy little loops where you can bunch it up and just tie the little like rubber band style band around it to keep it all in one place because otherwise you would have all of this strap just flailing. And so when carriers don't have these, it is such a turn off for me. I love the fact that Graco put this on here because you can just roll the strap like this and then put the handy dandy, put the handy little band around it and it keeps it so much more just like clean and simple. And as you're maneuvering out and about with the baby, you don't have to worry about those flailing straps. 
Aside from all of those cool features, the great thing about this carrier is that it actually has a couple different certifications that I had never heard of before and that not every carrier out there has. So I'll put the names here of the certifications they have, but basically one ensures that the product is free from har harmful substances. So you know that when you're carrying a baby in a carrier like this, they're probably chewing on it, especially this front bib. If they're facing out, they're gonna be chewing on it a lot. Arlo the other day had like a whole ring of spit on here and with their skin just touching it and being all over it that certification ensures that all of the fabrication and everything that goes into making this carrier is certified and safe for your baby so you don't have to worry about their skin touching it or their mouths being on it on top of that it also has a certification that it's healthy for your baby's hips like I said some carriers will have them like wide open in order to face in or out and because of the way that this carrier is formed it's not going to cause damage to your baby's hips the way some others might but the great thing too that great has thought of, I'm telling you they've thought of everything for this carrier, is that they're actually sending additional covers like this that you can put over those places where the baby might be chewing a lot or where you might notice dirt showing. That's another thing is that this carrier is machine washable. I've already washed mine too because I got makeup on it the first day I got it. Um, but if you want to, you can just throw it in the washer. I threw mine in the dryer as well and it was totally fine on low heat. So this definitely is machine washable, but we know it's kind of a hassle to throw things in the washer or sometimes you might not want to do a full deep clean so in between those you can just put these covers on those tough spots and then throw these in the washer instead so you'll get two of these extra little covers to go on the shoulder covers too. That's where you might notice yourself having some wear or you might notice baby's hands a little bit. So you get one for each side and then you get little covers for the front too. And these actually cover that front bib area. So they can button on and securely stay on there. But then when baby's chewing on it or if they're drooling or anything, it's going on this cover instead of on the carrier itself too. I think that's genius and just so, so convenient. Okay guys, so that's everything for this carrier. I know Graco has seriously thought of everything. I told them that when I met with them, when they went over the details, when the team showed this carrier to me, um, I told them, I swear you guys have thought of everything with this one. It's sort of like every inconvenience that you might notice with the baby carrier has been problem solved with this one, with this four in one from Great go. They're just a great company. They think of everything. They're trying to make things easier on us, which I so appreciate. Um, I'll have all the info for this in the description box down below. Thank you again to Great Go for working with me on this one. Let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.